Uh, well, my name is Tim. Uh, I work for uh, Mindloops, a company which I uh, created with two other guys. And I'm a software engineer, so I do for customers uh, creating uh, software. Cool. Great. My name is uh, Ramon Wieleman, or Raymond in English. Uh, I'm the founder of company Code Nomads, Java consultancy company in Amsterdam for English-speaking developers. Uh, and I'm also a board member of the Amsterdam Java Youth Group. Oh, nice. Yeah. Okay. So you did this uh, fantastic quiz. And so, um, <laughs> <laughs> so um, how did you come up uh, with this idea of uh, of doing like a live quiz? Yeah, I guess we s this, this was the third edition at uh, DevOps, and we started with it in 2015. A uh, good friend of mine, uh, Menno, which he, he did the largest music quiz, so on a, in a, in his inner city for a lot of people. And I thought, well, it's so so much fun. Why wouldn't something like that be appropriate for a uh, really great conference just like DevOps and we sat down with a couple of guys and just uh, started creating and um, yeah well this is the third uh, edition it's my first time I was the newbie so uh, uh, but he did a I, great I, job yeah, 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 yeah. I was the replacement so uh, uh, yeah it was fun to do it's really cool to yeah we, we, we partnered up and uh, you uh, gave a lot of technical questions as well yes Yes. Right, so the, the, the questions seem to be like simple and yet uh, so... No, not a, a little bit simple. Well, so, but also like a yeah. easy to, to miss. So how did yeah. you, how, what was the thinking? How did you come up with all these questions? Um, yeah, well, <laughs> we, we, we thought Sorry. let's uh, ask uh, questions that are kind of broad. Not okay. just uh, only specific to code, but also to framework uh, knowledge. So we have a lot of different questions and different teams with people from different backgrounds. So it's yeah. fun for everyone. That was mm -hmm, the main mm -hmm. idea. It should be fun for yeah. everyone. Yeah. Um, and if we look at uh, the rating, there are teams which rate really well, which do really well, but it, it differs. Today we had like from 19 points to 31. And, um, 32. 32, yeah, 32. 32. 32. The winner had 32 uh, points. And I thought, they can get about 40 points, right? Yeah, something like that, so, 40, so something 42. like that. So it's, it's, it's uh, not too difficult, I guess, but it's, there are difficult questions. So there were a total of what, uh, 36 questions? 31, so we came up with 31 questions. Oh, 31, okay. And uh, yeah, some of them were really serious Java questions. Uh, even though the multiple choice answers weren't that serious sometimes. Right. <laughs> that we just have two options and we need to think of two or three, two more, right? So that's... Yeah, to lure some people in, but also, well, my favorite question was, is the yeah. big data tool or is the Pokemon? And uh, I'm not so uh, into the world of big data frameworks, but I knew my Pokemon, so it was an easy question <laughs> for me. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> when you're sure it's a Pokemon, then you yeah. know the others are big data tools. So, and I yeah. think the question uh, about what, what is a native method in uh, yeah. Java uh, was fun as well, because we have three more serious options and the fourth one was of course created by a native american which yeah. which is kind of fun for the for the audience so we, we try to keep it light and fun and yeah yeah so um how i mean how did you come up with the implementation right because i mean it's um so you had everything ready right so describe like what uh the experience yeah we we, we kind of uh uh, created the questions uh, just in a mm -hmm. Word document and, and mm -hmm. gathered them together and then gave them to, to Menno, which is from Menno's largest music quiz. And he is really creative and not into IT at all. Yeah. So he sees, for instance, an, an, a question about strings and then he thinks of, of strings like not to wear. Java strings, <laughs> strings to wear. So that's, he, he creates all the, he does all the crea creativity with, uh, with PowerPoint. We yeah. sometimes call him a, a PowerPoint master because it's yeah. unbelievable oh, what he can do. Oh, this was PowerPoint. Yeah, yeah, it was yeah this, PowerPoint. this was PowerPoint. It's unbelievable. Okay, <laughs> because there were like little animations as well. Like yeah. Uh, no, yeah, a lot of animations. And we right. just wanted to create a feeling that you're actually in a bar instead of a, right. a basement in a cinema during a conference here at DevOx. And that's what we turned down the lights. We handed out beers, peanuts on the room. Just have fun. But the thing why we took the PowerPoint in this approach basically uh, is we were limited on time so we did it mm -hmm. during lunch break and we had exactly one hour so people come in rush in 
then we need to start, but we also need to finish before the other sessions start, right? So right. people need their good content as well, not fun only. As, as <laughs> Stefan uh, suggested uh, this year, that we do it during lunch, yeah. so we can combine both uh, both rooms and we have room for more people. Yeah. Because the previous editions, we did it in the evening, like at eight o'clock, and that was sold out as well. So there were <laughs> 60 people, 60 till 80 people, uh, yeah. but then nobody could fit in anymore. Yeah. So this year, we, uh, well, he suggested we could do it during lunch, yeah. and uh, which was a great thing because I think there were about 100 uh, people or more. Yeah, yeah. yeah. the room yeah. was pretty much full. Yeah. yeah, it was cool. So and um, so you gave prizes. So yeah. can you talk oh, about really that? Yeah, it was. It were really basic prizes. We just we we, we had an app group. So it was saying. Who took care of the prices? Oh shit. So this morning I went to the a beer shop to buy some nice beers. Uh, the people from DevOx provided us with a collector's item of a DevOx uh, winter hat. How do you say it? Yeah, that's the right yeah. word, right? And the book, right? And we went to the O'Reilly bookstore and I asked, well, do you want to give a prize? And because we want to give an encouragement. So for the team yeah. that had the least points, we took them on the stage, book. we handed them the book. So I'm sure they'll come back next year and win. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that's right because you gave a prize to the to yeah, the team yeah, that yeah, really yeah, lost yeah, yeah, right yeah, yeah, yeah. that's an encouragement it yeah, was an encouragement yeah. to come that's, back that's next year. Yeah, yeah absolutely um anything else you want to i mean do you want to do that again yeah, if yeah. We, we would love and to come back yeah, it's cool. great someday, to do someday i hope we'll be in the cinema yeah, yeah. You know, on, a, on a really oh, big yes. screen and then have kind of like an app in which people can oh. so that's that's, that's that, our dream that will be Really fun, right? That will be our challenge for next year. So now we just had a paper and people right. need to write it down and the neighbors check the neighbors scores. Yeah, there's a it's fun, so it's not intended to give the perfect score and to have right. a zero percent uh, fault rate, but maybe next time we make an app, do it in a big cinema room. That's yeah. the or be part of the uh, event uh, app, right? That Ooh, would be that's just even better. Oh, that would be even better. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Great <Thank> suggestion. You. <laughs> Noted. <laughs> Noted. Because it's just a page, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So you don't have. Did you like it? Oh yes, I did. 